As I came from the Father, and I have come into the world, so I am leaving the world and going to the Father. My dear friends in Christ, in the Gospel of St. John, chapter 16, verse 28, Jesus tells us that He came from the Father and He came into this world and now He needs to return to the Father. My dear friends, Jesus understood from where He came and to where He has to once again go. He knew that He came from the Father and he knew that he has to return to the Father as well. And he understood the reality of this fact. And he knew how he needs to live on this earth. Just because he could realize and understand the reality of his life. Something that we will never be able to understand sometime until even at the, at the moment of our death is that we don't belong to this earth. And Jesus could understand that. Jesus understood very well that he did not belong to this world. That's why he could say this. But we in turn are unable to understand that we don't belong to this world. That's why we live in this world as if we are going to live for eternity. That's why we grab things day by day. That's why we yearn for power and wealth so much. Sometime presuming all what we accumulate will be also ours for eternity and we could take them everything at our death but my dear friends today jesus tells us clearly that we don't belong to this world and we need to move on we need to move on to the next level that is from where we came to the father and this life is given for a test we need to pass this test unless and until we pass this test we will not be able to move once again to the father and that is the eternal condemnation and who condemns we ourselves condemn my dear friends it is not God who condemns because it is the test that is given for us to pass so if we fail the test we ourselves have to re remain for the eternal sorrow and suffering. My dear friends, we need to understand this. We need to always cater to this. We need to understand that we are temporary being on this planet earth. And this temporal life is given for you and for me to have a permanent base in the next so let's try our best to live according to the word of God which is the directive of our life it gives us insights over insights it gives us ways to live in doing so we will be able to inherit the eternal bliss and the eternal life of which is guaranteed in the Lord himself my dear friends because he came and lived and went back and showed us the way and he said I am the way so when he becomes my way I know how to live in this planet called earth let us strive hard to understand this. Let us strive hard to know and believe that the Lord is always with me to encourage me to live according to the way that He lived in this planet. My dear friends, it is not easy. 
it's very demanding it's very challenging sometimes it's very trying but whatever the circumstances are whatever the situations are we need to practice and live our religion according to the ways and according to the statutes of the lord when we live by the commands of the lord my dear friends we will be able to rejoice over life and we will be able to detach from all worldly allurements and live our life so simple and joyful amen god bless you have a nice day